Hi guys. <laughs> Hi guys. Okay, so this is the beginning of our Panama City Beach weekend vlog. We're going to see Keith's mom and hopefully it'll be sunny on Friday. It's supposed to be rainy all weekend. That's why I'm carrying this bag. Plus when I travel, I love to carry a tote. So I also have my Gucci hat. I'm gonna wear it. And I have on a pair of shorts, Birkenstocks, and a black tank top. And we're gonna get on the road and I will catch you guys in a bit. Peace. Hi again. Say hi, Keith. Hi, Keith. <laughs> okay, so we just had a pit stop. I'm excited, you guys. I love the beach when all the kids go back to school and it's kind of quiet. It's my favorite time to go. Hopefully we'll get in one good beach day, right? Yeah. I would say we'll probably get there around 11. What do you think? 10.39. <gasps> 10 10.39. If we don't stop. If we don't stop. 10.39 if we don't stop. All right, I'll check you guys in a bit. Okay guys, we made it. We are in Panama City and we are at Keith's mom's house. So it's around midnight, right? Midnight? So we're just gonna lay around in bed and kind of wind down from the drive. And we'll just see what we can get into tomorrow. I think we're gonna go to the beach tomorrow and it's supposed to rain this weekend. So we'll see how it goes, but I'm excited to be here. I'm glad that you guys are here with us. And Keith, do you have anything to say? What do you want me to say? <laughs> okay guys, I'll see you in the morning. Good night. <laughs> Good morning. Okay. <laughs> I think Keith's a little perturbed with me this morning. So, the water is out in the building and it's supposed to be turned back on today and so keith's mom filled up all the bathtubs with water so we'd have a fresh supply of water and ever since last night like you're supposed to dip out some water when you need it and ever since last night i've been washing my hands <laughs> supply <laughs> so, this morning Keith comes in there with a pitcher a coffee pot I mean <laughs> can't even tell it okay he comes in with a coffee pot gonna make coffee and dipped it in the water supply and I've been washing my hands in it the whole time and he almost made contaminated coffee and then I I panicked because I forgot I mean like I didn't think and then I had to tell him <laughs> what I had done because I just couldn't let him get some kind of disease <laughs> look look how mad he is <laughs> So now we only have contaminated water. Well, we have some bottled water, but anyway. Are you mad? Best Keith? answer is no. Keith, do you have anything to say? No. <laughs> oh man, I hope they turn the water back on today. Cause if they don't, what are we gonna do? Huh? Have a truck stop, I guess. <laughs> He's mad. I ruined the whole water supply but I just couldn't let him drink contaminated coffee see Keith I was looking out for you I was looking out for you Keith uh -huh. oh god he's mad okay so anyway <laughs> that's what happened this morning okay so I'm gonna go have some coffee and I'll see you guys in a bit snookums mm -hmm. are you mad no you're not mad Mm -mm. Well, see, that was real nice of me not letting you drink contaminated water. Yeah, but you can. Now, if I want to wash my hands, I have to wash my hands with dirty water, so I'm just putting dirt back on my hands. Well, your hands are dirty anyway. Yeah, but I want them to be clean. So yeah. I need clean water to wash them off. Well, Keith, at least I didn't let you make a pot of contaminated coffee and drink it. Snookums? Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Look at him. He's mad. <laughs> oh, what a way to start the day, right? Well, you guys, I mean, I had to come clean. <sighs> Hope they turn the water on today because all we have is contaminated water now. All right, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. I need some coffee. Hey, Snooks. Mm -hmm. Are you still mad? <laughs> Anybody could have done it. No, only you. <laughs> okay, so we are going to go down to the beach. It's I guess my last day at the beach for the entire summer until next year. So we're going to go down there and spend a couple hours, get a little sun, and then we'll come up here, probably have something to eat, and we might do a little shopping later, not sure. But anyway, so off to the beach. What do you have to say? What do you want me to say? <laughs> okay, guys, so I know you guys are all worried about this. Um, the water is back on in the building, so we got to let the uh, contaminated water out of the bathtub. <laughs> so I think Keith's over his little mad spell. Say hello to our little friends. Our little friends. I think he's looking at me. <laughs> Come here. If we had a here he comes.
little candy store. So we got some candy. What you got, Keith? What all did you pick? Ooh, trick or treat time. <laughs> I know, he got all kinds of stuff. All kinds of gummies and Coke. What's that? Let me taste it. Yeah, not what I was expecting. Just sugar. Yeah. Doesn't taste orangey, does it? No. Birch Outlet, and we're in Seagrove right now, and we were scoping out a house to get for the summer, and this is what we get. Yeah. I really need it to stop raining, I guess is. Do you know what this is? This is the prime example of being so close, yet so far away. <laughs> I either have to get get out and swim or just sit here for a while. Look at this. We're parked right in front of Tory Birch. What do you have to say, Keith? What do you want me to say? <laughs> I'm hungry. I need a grouper sandwich. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take that grouper sandwich and shove it down your throat. <laughs> Oh, are you now? Yep, I'm tired of hearing about it. Are you? Well, I'm tired of this rain. Look at this. It's ridiculous. Okay, guys, so we went shopping to the outlets, and there's some of the damage. I went to uh, Tory Birch and Coach, and it was raining so hard, you guys, I just wasn't feeling it. So I got a couple of things for myself that I will show you guys next week, and a couple of other gifts that I can't tell you about and we are gonna go pick up Keith's mom and we're gonna go have some dinner and what do you think I'm gonna order Keith? You're getting a grouper sandwich. <laughs> One way or another, right? You know what yep. Keith? I don't know. I, I might just get scallops. No, you're getting a grouper sandwich. <laughs> and how am I getting it? I'm gonna shove it down your throat. <laughs> since we've been here I've been like I really want a grouper sandwich but anyway so yeah I just wasn't feeling vlogging in the stores there were quite a few people in there and sometimes in, I'm in one of those moods that I don't really care if people are staring at me today it wasn't one of those days so I just wanted to get some stuff and I think the rain kind of threw a damper on it but anyway so we're gonna go have dinner in a bit and I'll check you guys later hi guys all right, it's Saturday night. It is almost 10 o'clock and uh, we've been watching a movie and we went out to dinner. We had a fabulous dinner and I had a uh, grouper piccata. I didn't have a grouper sandwich, <laughs> but I had grouper piccata and it was really good. And I have most of my stuff packed up. There's my Vera Bradley duffel bag and um, it was a fabulous weekend, you guys. I'm really glad that I brought you guys along, and we always love to come here and spend time with Keith's mom. And we'll be back in 
we'll be back for Thanksgiving. We've already committed uh, that we're gonna be here on Thanksgiving. So I love Panama City Beach, you guys, so much. It's, it's our home away from home. It's a really special time to be able to come here and spend time with Keith's mom and uh, do a little shopping. We used to go to the movies a lot, but we don't do that anymore. I'm just really happy that I was able to bring you guys along with us and I will see you guys again in a couple of days. Bye-bye.